is not able to land the sleep. But G2 are fully committing to the team fight. They've gone for double AP solo laners. They've got AD jungle. And then obviously Sivir, which is a team fight monster. I think they're like, when you look so, he is playing towards his strong side. And Broken Blade has to respect it. He doesn't have a jungler. He doesn't have a jungler, but a flashing because they want to get the stun down. You can see Syncroft's looking for him, and they know there's no flash on a Gwen. First blood to BDS. And we gank, which then gave room for Yankos to be able to make this play on towards the Drake. Yes, yeah, Syncroft tries to get in range, but the smite was not up. Yankos now going to disengage. Bot side, and now the Herald has spawned. And look, these resets have come through, and here Ooh. comes the collapse. They're going to try and collapse on the Gregor. Sivo is broken by pops down the needlework. He does get a two man stun, but can he get out alive? That is the question. The answer is yes, he can. And now we're going to see a 2v2 on the top side, as we can see now. Yankos and Broken Blade trying to run away. Yankos hasn't got anywhere to be, and Sinkrop takes down the enemy jungler. Limit here from BDS is really good there, making it very awkward for G2 to actually approach the lane. They can't gain access to the wave. The oh, ultimate. Oh, that Moonlight Vigil was fantastic. It's Maddie, and then bopped away is Yankos. So they get a full charge. They'll get the full tower as well. This is honestly magnificent coming out from the side of BDS. They're Move just. They're seeing. No, lands the bubble there. The Jersey will come out. They'll get themselves a Q as well. Tongue Lash will not land, so no licking for you. As everyone kind of walks back with their tail He's between their legs. For it, though. BDS are still hunting. Able to rotate first down towards the bot side, but it didn't matter because the moment that he arrived, Sikor made the smart decision to just yeet Yankos out of there, keeping that numbers equal. Three versus three in the bot side of the map. But for Zoe to be able to get the push in that wave is a lot harder, but they can still access the Herald by moving through top. So now they push in this wave. Now they move down towards the... You will even see they're just kind of aggressively pushing forward with the Hextech Rocket Bell pushing themselves in. They won't get the tower just yet, but it is just one push away. And now with the Hex Flash over the wall, Syncroft might fancy himself. He finds himself a Caps. He does get himself with Demonic Ascension, but the Lulu is dead, as is the Sivir. They don't want the Dragon Venius. They want the kills. And that seed that you knew needed blood is starting to get pretty damn big into a tree. Yankos, though, you can see the power of this, uh, uh, this Swain really moving forward. Now they can't kill off the Swain Caps is still alive. One more auto attack will do it. And next man will pick up a double kill. Now Broken Blade. Can he get anything else? Sink back live. They want to go again. Syncroft is unafraid. Actually, never mind. Syncroft is very afraid. Never mind. He even jump back. Looks like he was hex fracking back over the wall. The Drowsy does come in. That's going to be onto Yanko's. A double knock up here. And yes, you may have got the Dragon G2, but do you get out with your lives? The answer is no. It's still two minutes until the Baron. But right now, we can see the BDS is committing to the top side once more. They have five members. Yankos. Yankos is looking for the fight. He's looking for the fight, looking for a 1v1 right now. Does pop it down onto Xmati, and Xmati's dead. Yeah, ooh, Limit, he flashed in. And that's going to try and save his, his AD carry, and it's just not going to work. BDS, you can see. Collapse onto the mid lane. You do have a Nash's 2 Gwen closing in from the side there, so Broken Blade's going to look for something with caps as well. Nuclear gets caught out a little bit over the side. He's trying to be cheeky with those portal jumps, and now Broken Blade trying to see if he can catch on to Agarcevo. Caps gets knocked out, so now it's a 5v4 in favor of BDS, but already health bars chunked out. Nuclear Int and Limit. This is happening, but BDS don't know that for sure. Now a war goes down, as eventually the Dragon will be secured. That is soul point and the most important. Got a 2 out of spike now onto Broken Blade. Big one for caps as well with the Rylas Crystal set there in the Imperial Mandate, and Broken now, Blade... Things are coming down. Yankos smells something's up. The vision will be spotted by Caps. They know this is going on. Will BDS just flip the Baron? They're just kind of committing right now. There's going to be a TP into the pit. Limit trying to see if he can play keep away as Yankos, Yankos gets knocked back. That's the dummy, though. That's not even Yankos. You got baited just as much as they did, and there's going to be the cannon going down. Now Limit trying to go for it. You've no poppy. And BDS, your early game was fantastic, but G2 are just running you down around the Baron pit. You can't close out this game and they went straight back to pushing in that mid lane so that's going to be baron now for g2 that's a fantastic little bar red bull baron to flash over the wall to help him but limit is isolated x matty and nuclear ink can't do anything the baron is actually killing x matty here this win they will join the top five which seems to be separating yeah, we'll see now. Aggressivo, mm -hmm. seeing if he gets caught out here. They never move, not quite. A minute's time. It would be great, but they have the option of choice. They can decide to go for top side, push in these ways, get drag or vision control around. There. That's exactly what they're going to go for. But it's been spotted out. They know it's coming in because they have got a ward. Now he knows he's been spotted. Aggressivo flashes in. Yankos trying to take out Targamus. They get the double man knock up, but it's a Lulu. So difficult to actually burn that health bar down. It's a fight on two fronts. Three v two and a three v two. But look at the Infelios. Limit goes down, and there's X Maddy. It's a double kill with this broken blade scissors. It's just too damn big. BDS tried everything. They threw everything in the kitchen sink. But G2, they have gotten themselves to the late game.
commandingly win the team fight and they will secure themselves the Dragon Soul. It was such a good early game for BDS, but they faltered in the mid game. They lost the Baron and G2's team comp came online. They're looking to take down as many members as possible. Broken Blade will pick it up and they're left to run away. Difficult and difficult. BDS are being pulled, stretched around the map. They need to make a decision. They try to go on to Broken Blade, but it's a level Ooh. 17. Gwen, who is immune, and Caps tries to make that one work. Now it's Maddie without a time can to save him, and Caps feeling confident. Caps goes in with the wild growth to get the knockup. Edgar Sibo is there. The Moonlight Vigil is pretty decent, but no one goes down beside a G2. I lie. Caps is finally taken out, and it's a trade Through this off. Baron, Yankos should have information that it has been started. Here we go, they're gonna have the pink one in the back of the They've pit. It's gonna commit. be 50 50, it's gonna be a committal, and it's stolen! G2 Yankos will get himself the Baron, and X Maddie will just turn back onto these teammates, but he cannot do anything else. G2, they just absolutely decimate BDS. You have to go for something. BDS just cannot find a Baron. Yankos took it away earlier, and he takes it away again. With a soul, with a baron, with a nexus in their eyes, G2 is looking to go to seven wins. And they will destroy their kryptonite, put it into the back of their minds. You only beat G2 Esports once, BDS. And they should be able to get themselves up to seven and five. And all of a sudden, our playoff race is hot up. G2, typical in G2 fashion. They're looking for more kills. They're looking for more fights. The ultimate will come out from Synchrov. Oh, Caps could be in some danger. Delivered. <laughs> Delivered to the fountain laser. I'd like to see that, but G2, they've got Flacken on the Nexus. This is going to be the win, and this is going to be them very much securing themselves towards that playoff spot.